Whoa! It is actually really dark, and you can hear the animals. I see you have a stick. Everything, not a stick, a weapon. Oh, it's a weapon. Oh my god. <laughs> so the wind destroyed my tent. <laughs> There's a tree falling onto my tent. My name is Michael. After traveling to over 40 countries, 2021 has been a turning point. This year, a short notice career break gave me the opportunity to jump on a last minute flight to a childhood dream of mine, Africa. As a kid, I used to be a big animal nerd, spending evenings watching National Geographic and the weekends in my local zoo. This time, I had a rare opportunity to explore a truly untamed and wild continent all by myself. Welcome to my adventure in Kenya, and welcome to Michael Wonder World. Please hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more adventures. We're in Masamara. Yeah, we're in the park right now, driving toward the uh, camp. Masamara is uh, one of the most famous uh, national parks here yeah. in Africa, actually. Yeah, in Africa, in Africa, in one of the ones. Yeah, so Masamara is together uh, connected with uh, Serengeti in Tanzania. It's separated by a river called the uh, Masai River. Yes, Masai River. <laughs> and from this parking lot, we can take this bridge from where animals live to where we're gonna stay that's our tents So it's a hiding bridge, which means it's shaky. But well, if monkeys can do it, I can do it, right? Right now I'm at the base camp Masamara and uh, this is my tent. I have a really lovely swing right here. And uh, I also have a sitting area right here. What's super amazing is this view. I'm right on top of the river. And let's check out inside. Inside the tent, I have two beds because, well, one bed is not big enough for me. I have a uh, sort of a closet area here. This is a bathroom. I have a shower, a toilet. mirror and uh, the highlight of this tent is really this follow me open the tent another mirror it's a outside shower look around this is a shower underneath a tree oh my god i'm totally gonna have a shower here tonight this is super awesome.
so I'm just about to take a shower and look what I found in my shower. As we enjoy the companionship of the elephants, our satellite radio calling about the sighting of lions nearby. 
so we immediately started the engine and raced to the crime scene with full speed. However, what I didn't expect was the insanity of the traffic situation when we got there. We are trying to find a line hidden in these bushes. There are a lot of cars here. I'll try to find one line. Masamara is definitely the most famous park of all Kenya. Even during COVID, we encountered this parade of jeeps exploring through bushes, all trying to find a single line, but no one had any success until... his box. <laughs> Those are huge balls. So Vincent, first day game drive here in Masamara, we saw how many big fights? Uh, let's say we got the lines. Elephant, yes. Buffalo, buffalo. But uh, we saw six cheetahs. Eh? No, yeah. six of them. We yeah. saw three of the big five, but the best part was uh, we saw cheetah. So cheetah, and we saw the male lion. Yeah. Quite huge one. A big male lion. Okay, fun fact. When I check into this camp, um, they gave me this flashlight and uh, they said when it's dark outside I have to use this flashlight to flash so someone will come to pick me up and escort me to wherever I need to go so it's already dark after sunset but I still need to go to the restaurant to have dinner so I guess I have to use this to have a Maasai escort to walk me like 100 meters to the restaurant whoa it is actually really dark and you can hear the animals. Oh, really? Uh, on this side as well? Yeah. On this side of the river? Yeah. Hyenas, lions, leopard? <laughs> oh, but I see you have a stick. Everything, not a stick, a weapon. Oh, it's a weapon. Before we head out, just want to show you something really interesting. So here in the jungle and in the national reserve, you really live with the elements. So last night when I came back from the safari, the hotel told me that a tree branch has fallen down onto my roof. And uh, this is what happened. You can see that a whole branch is over there. So the base camp guys were super nice and they offered to change room for me, but it was my last night here. Um, and I didn't want to pack everything 
move and then unpack everything and then pack everything again this morning. So I decided to stay here and they already cleaned up the entire area. It looked a lot worse. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> so the wind destroyed my tent. <laughs> There's a tree falling onto my tent. <laughs> I mean it's okay like I'm j I can just walk this way so that's fine <laughs> So we can just leave it like this? Yeah, we can leave it like this. It's no problem. I'm just now gonna walk this way. What happened in the jungle stays in the jungle, right? Unless it stays on YouTube.